And time now for a look through the international headlines for following this Thursday lunchtime. For that, we turn to our Eunice Kim standing by at the News Center. Uh, Eunice, there is global outrage over the latest shelling by Israel of another UN school in Gaza, and it's said to be the biggest refugee camp in the region. That's right, Mark. That UN school was sheltering some 3,300 Palestinians, and after Wednesday's assault that struck before daybreak, authorities say at least 17 people were killed and 90 others were wounded. It was the sixth UN school to be hit in this conflict, the second with deadly consequences. Devastated, the chief of the UN's main relief agency in Gaza called on the world to take deliberate international political action to end the continuing carnage. At least 16 Palestinians were also killed and more than 200 wounded in an Israeli strike that hit a crowded shopping area in the Shijaya district of Gaza City. Both attacks came during a four-hour truce called by the Israeli military, which was rejected by Hamas as meaningless. Wednesday's events now put the death toll of Palestinians above 1,300 and Israel's at 58. Most of the Palestinian deaths have been of civilians and many of those have been women and children.